Hello, welcome to another episode of PSLE Science Made Simple. My name is Firhat and I'm the PSLE Science Specialist here from the PIG Lab. In this video, I'll be analysing a past year examination question from the topic of electricity. I've put this question in a handout and you can download a copy for free by clicking on the link in the description box below. Let's get started. Study the circuit diagram shown below. All the identical bulbs, A, B, C and D, lit up when the switch was closed. This means that all bulbs are in working condition. Let's trace the possible pathways that electricity can flow through this circuit to make all the bulbs light up. Remember, electricity is produced by the battery. So we start drawing one possible pathway that electricity can flow through the wires and electricity needs to flow back to the battery. Is there another possible pathway for electricity to flow through? Yes, there is. So let's trace that pathway using another color. Again, we start from the battery and electricity will flow through this wire now and flow back to the battery. The question says, which bulb, when removed from its bulb holder, will cause the rest of the bulbs not to light up? In other words, will removing this bulb create an open or closed circuit with the other bulbs? Yes, that's right, it's an open circuit. An open circuit will not allow electricity to flow through the other bulbs, hence preventing them from lighting up. The trick to this question is to find a bulb that sits on both pathways so that when we remove this bulb, we create a gap in both the pathways. Now, which bulb sits on both the pathways that we have just highlighted? That's right, we will choose bulb A as both electrical pathways pass through bulb A. So if we were to remove bulb A like this, Is there an open or closed circuit with the other bulbs? Open circuit. Can electricity still flow through the other bulbs in the circuit? No. Will the other bulbs light up? No. Hence, choosing bulb A will cause the rest of the bulbs not to light up, giving us the answer as option number one. Thank you for watching and I hope you enjoyed this video. If you found this video useful, do give us a thumbs up. If you want to check out the other videos, click on the links on the right hand side. And finally, don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more interesting videos. Thank you and I'll see you next time. Bye!